Hello everyone and welcome to my channel, Siriana Tarot. This is going to be an energy check-in love reading for my dearest Taurus. Taurus, we're going to take a look at the person most on your mind or your current situation. And if these messages resonate with you, I am going to ask that you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's see what clear messages, advice, and guidance come through for my dearest Taurus for their highest and greatest good. Okay, so we have the King of Cups. Your person is showing up as the Five of Swords. They're viewing you as the Empress, wow. What you're not seeing is the Seven of Pentacles. And we have the Hierophant Taurus energy coming through. We have a Taurus coming through really strong, also Libran energy. And we have the Six of Pentacles. So this is a reminder that what's looking, what you're looking for is looking for you. I think you've got a love offer here. Some of you, it's going to be some type of reconciliation, but I don't, I, I'm not getting that for a lot of you. I feel like you have somebody around you who's been healing, who's been taking their time because they want victory and success with you. They see you as their person. They want marriage and commitment. I mean, this is really powerful energy here for my Taurus. All right. So the King of Cups tells me you have somebody that's looking for commitment and security. Um, and there's blessings coming your way here for sure with this relationship, a balanced and reciprocated connection. The Lovers in Reverse Gemini energy and the Eight of Cups. Somebody here is walking away from a player. Now, it could be you. It could be this person. They might be healing from that. Maybe you've had like you know, you've had a run in with a player and you're just feeling a little bit like, oh, gosh, you know, like dating's tough or, you know, maybe, yeah, just feeling like a little disillusioned here is what I'm getting. But this person is a blessing coming your way. Um, they're in a healed energy and they are willing to fight for you, Taurus. Yeah, King of Cups. They, they might be a Cancer Scorpio or Pisces person, but they definitely have this watery energy. And the Wheel of Fortune, this is part of your destiny. This is also someone who has a lot to offer. Now, with the Empress energy, Taurus and Libran energy, um, this person is seeing you as their person. They're seeing you as their wife, as their husband, as their partner. Um, they're seeing you as their destiny, as their soulmate, as their divine counterpart. All right. They, they feel like maybe they've been waiting for you to heal from something. It could be something as simple as like an illness, okay, or an injury, or something like that, but um, but I, I feel like, too, you bring peace to this person. This person feels like they really like that you, you do things kind of in a, I'm not going to say a slow way, but I'm seeing like a sensual way, but also that you're like a, you know, you're not like in a rush, and I think they really like that. They're very passionate about you, Knight of Wands, and they do see you as, again, not like slow by any means or slow moving, but they also know that, you know, that you do things like passionately, sensually, um, but in your own way. And they're very, they're in this, there's this Venusian energy that they just really love about you. Now the Knight of Wands does move kind of quickly here, but more so I'm reading this as like, they've just got really great passion for you and attraction. What you're not seeing is this person is, is strategizing. They're taking their time. This is somebody that wants victory and success. They want marriage. They want commitment. They want something solid and secure. They've been holding back, building up their strength, but this person has this beautiful Leo energy about them. So even though they may have been through a lot lately, they're still optimistic, especially when it comes to you. This is somebody who's loyal. This is somebody who's got a really big heart and the Ten of Pentacles. This is somebody who has really worked hard for what they have and, and they choose you. They want to share what they've worked for with you. They want to either build a family, a future, a home, you know, a, a, a solid connection with you. This is gorgeous. Hierophant energy is telling me, Taurus, that you two are going to fit in very well with friends and family. I feel this is absolutely a blessing here for you. Um, most likely it's karmic justice. It's what you've been waiting for. Your friends and family are going to be happy and supportive of this. The page of wands. Okay, some of you, you might feel like it's too good to be true. Um, the seven of cups, though, tells me that I feel this person is going to reassure you real fast um, or be quite reassuring that this is the right decision. This is your person. Um, yeah, this is somebody that I feel you absolutely will marry. Okay. And there might be, it might even happen kind of quickly. So just get ready. It's, it feels like a beautiful tower moment, right? <laughs> this person coming into your life. All right. So yeah, they're coming out as this Leo energy. So they could be a Leo if you don't know who this person is yet. 
Um, but I'm also getting this person is really, they are very loyal and they're very optimistic. They're kind. Um, they're happy. They're going to bring you happiness and warmth, joy. Leo energy is also very sexy energy. All right. The rebuild card. Yeah. This person may have rebuilt their fortune after some sort of loss. Um, but I'm also seeing here that the tower moment, you know, this is going to be a tower moment, but in the best possible way. And it's going to be a very, very sensual connection. Okay. And yeah, this person's coming towards you. It might be happening or unfolding by summertime. If you don't know who this person is, if you have been seeing this person and you know who I'm talking about, there could be some type of proposal come, you know, July or August here. All right. So let's see. Um, let's see what else we need to know. Any other advice for my Taurus, please? Any other advice for my Taurus, please? Mindful wisdom, create inner harmony. Yeah, so just be at peace. Focus on your own balance here. Um, trust your intuition when it comes to this person. Third eye vision, reclaim your mind. So, you know, unblock that third eye chakra. Again, trust your intuition here, Taurus. Because there may be like a little bit of a moment of like, I don't, I don't trust this, right? But I, I feel like it's coming from this is too good to be true or things are happening kind of fast. The right person is not going to rush you. Okay, but you know, sometimes when we've been really hoping and praying for something and, it, and it's dropped on our lap, we can distrust it, right? And between worlds, new directions, get ready. A lot of my Taurus, like I said, you're in this in-between area. Oh, I love this for you. I do. I love this. It feels really good. It feels like this is your person. It feels like this is your happy ending. All right, so we're getting lyrics coming through. Um, we have Erica Badu. I guess I'll see you next lifetime. No hard feelings. I guess I'll see you next lifetime. I'm going to be there. So this is somebody that you may have had or you feel like if you don't know them, you don't know who they are. There's a sense of familiarity about them. And that's usually because you have some sort of past life connection. Um, some of you, um, you may also be saying goodbye to somebody. Okay. Like this player energy. It's okay. Let it go. Um, and, but everything means nothing. If I ain't got you, this, this person, they want you and only you. And I wouldn't need the radio to be my lullaby if I had you. So this is somebody who's definitely, they're hoping and praying for you as well, Taurus. Wow. These are beautiful messages. Your friends and have your friends and family are going to rejoice. They're going to be happy for you. Um, yeah, I'm excited. Beautiful energy here for my dear Taurus, sending you so much love and light. Um, if these messages resonate, drop me a comment. Let me know how. Um, but also check out the description box for ways you can get a private reading or if you like the cards I'm using or if you want to follow me on TikTok and Instagram. Love and light. Take care.